Hey guys, welcome to Action Figures and Hot Wheels Car Collectors. Today we're going to be checking out the 83 Chevy Silverado from HW Slam Series from Mattel's Hot Wheels Mainline Series. That is correct, my friends. We have this beautiful truck inside the Blister Card packaging. I love the color scheme used, which is black, orange, and yellow. We'll go through uh, the car and the packaging just a bit. Uh, just to give you the uh, details, uh, it came into production in the year 2008 under uh, Modern Classics. Uh, that was a segment uh, back then in 2008. And uh, the designer for this car is none other than very talented John Amai. He's the one who actually designed this particular car. Uh, and I believe that uh, this car came into, uh, I'm not sure, but it came into different movies as such. Uh, I believe that it came in uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre uh, 2. I'm not sure, but that could be the movie that it came in. Uh, and I, I, if I'm not wrong, I believe it came in uh, the movie called uh, No Country for Old Men. Uh, this could be the one or it may be a different uh, car that, that were used. Uh, because uh, as far as I know, uh, I'm a big fan of that movie. But uh, the cars that were used... Um, uh, I, I believe it was 1937 uh, Chevrolet Impala, uh, the 1988 Chevrolet uh, Caprice, and we have the 1977 Buick uh, Skylark, uh, 69 Chevrolet, I guess maybe Chevrolet Noah as well. These are some of the cars that were used. I believe 1983 uh, Chevy Silverado was also been used in that particular movie. So it came into uh, different movies, but it's a very famous car. Um, or a pickup truck that were used in the 80s. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at the packaging and the car itself. All right, um, the name appears at the bottom. It says 83 Chevy Silverado. Uh, we also have the Mattel logo on the left. We have the HW Slammed series written on the right with the logo. And uh, the number it says one out of five. So, so this is the first vehicle out of five. Uh, and look at this beautiful image of the truck, guys. I mean, I completely love the color scheme used. Um, you know, the orange yellow uh, goes with the black, uh, complete black color used on the car. It's kind of a vibrant color used uh, for the car. So I completely love that. Check out the double headlights, uh, the grill, which is huge. And we have side mirrors and all this stuff. So we'll go through that uh, when you look at the car. Uh, we also have the Hot Wheels logo here on the front. As we turn around to the back side, uh, we have the same basic information. Uh, the logo is for HW Slam series, uh, the number uh, says one out of five. We also have the name here, Chevy Silverado uh, Slam series. Multilingual information about warning and the warning sign. Uh, we also have the manufacturing and import details, customer complaint, uh, the BIS certification for imports in India. Uh, some uh, company codes and logos for the Hot Wheels website and uh, the Service Mattel website as well with the barcode here. Uh, again, some multilingual information here on the, on the base as well. All right, uh, that was the packaging for uh, the mainline series. Let's take a closer look at the car itself. I mean, I, I mean, I completely love the details uh, on the car. Look at the uh, look at the grill and the headlights. This is awesome, guys, which is like completely vac metal or chrome used. Uh, look at the bumper. It is completely chrome as well, which I love. Uh, as we check the side panels, uh, the door and the uh, rear side, uh, we have complete red color, I guess. Uh, yeah, there's a stripe of red. We have orange and we have yellow stripes as well. Uh, I love the detail here. We have the uh, painted side uh, turn signals, I guess, or the blinker. Uh, the tires are huge, uh, which I like, and uh, it's completely black with silver rims. Uh, it's, it's the same black metal used at the base, uh, so it's the same color. Uh, the car itself is completely black from top to bottom. Just the side panels, we have the color there. Uh, we also have the, uh, as we turn around the back side, we also have the painted tail lights this time, which is awesome. We also have the Chevrolet logo on the back door. Uh, which is nice. We have two exhaust uh, at the back. Uh, as we check the bottom, we have the S18 casting, which is new for 2023. Uh, we have a plastic base. Uh, we have the metal body. Uh, this car itself, or the pickup truck itself, feels really heavy when it, when you you know try to uh, lift the uh, car. Uh, it looks, it's look heavier. Uh, it feels heavier 
uh, compared to the other cars. And as we check the top, uh, we just have the basic details. We have some space there at the back. Uh, the roof is completely black. Uh, the hood is completely black as well. We have translucent uh, windscreen uh, and uh, the side glass as well. All right, guys, there you go. That That is the review for the 83 Silverado. Uh, Chevy Silverado. Comments down below if you have this particular version uh, or the version that were uh, that came into production in 2008. Uh, it came into many uh, different color schemes and uh, super treasure hunts, treasure hunts. And I believe the one that was made in China, uh, it, it was limited in production. I guess there were just 3,000 cars made, which was like lime green color, uh, and it has rubber tires as well. Uh, it was not uh, the um, super treasure hunt series, but I guess that was a premium series used. Uh, but I'm really not sure about that. Uh, so, yeah, there you go, my friends. That is a review for the 83 Chevy Silverado. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Uh, if you're watching the video, please make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Uh, people have already subscribed to the channel. Thank you so much for doing so. Until next time, guys, happy collecting and take care.